Hello and welcome to I Nurture videos. In this video, we will discuss the network security administration. At the end of this video, you will be able to explain about the network security administration. In any efficient network, it is very important to monitor the security activities of the network. Security monitoring takes proper security decisions to implement the appropriate security policies in the network. It also involves administration of secured activities on the network. Network security administration is not only just installing security updates and intrusion monitoring, but taking preventive procedures on various malicious activities. There are three basic factors in network security administration. Network administrative principles, network security applications, and network security strategies. Let's see each factor one by one. Network administrative principles. There are different networks administrative principles defined to administrate a secured network. Some principles are as follows. VLAN management. VLAN or virtual local area network is referred to as hardware driven network segment which is developed by switches. VLAN management develops a secured communication layer between different VLANs in the network and avoids various types of security threats in the network. Secure router configuration. It provides the security configurations for routers to perform day-to-day -day router activities on the network. Access control lists, ACL. It verifies valid and non-valid users range to perform the activities in the network. The ACL defines security rules to control the activities of various users on the network. Port security. It defines proper security guidelines and procedures to protect from different types of security attacks on the network at the port level. Rule-based management. It defines the set of rules for the secured communication among different devices in the network. It also monitors IT events through secure rules driven system in the network. Firewall rules. It defines the security rules for communicating with different firewalls in the network. Firewall provides the access to the network only to the set of authorized users on the network. Network security plays a major role across all the layers of